हेलो गाइस दिस इज महिमा सिंह एंड यू आर वाचिंग डिकोडिंग द इकोनॉमी द यूनियन कैबिनेट चेयर बाय प्राइम मिनिस्टर नरेंद्र मोदी हैज अप्रूव्ड अ ट्रांसफॉर्मेशनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशनल रीस्ट्रक्चरिंग ऑफ इंडियन रेलवेज दिस हिस्टोरिक रिफॉर्म विल गो अ लॉन्ग वे इन अचीविंग गवर्नमेंट्स विजन ऑफ मेकिंग इंडियन रेलवेज द ग्रोथ इंजन ऑफ इंडियाज विकास यात्रा दिस रिफॉर्म इंक्लूड्स यूनिफिकेशन ऑफ एग्जिस्टिंग एट ग्रुप ए सर्विसेज ऑफ इंडियन रेलवे इन टू सेंट्रल सर्विस कॉल्ड इंडियन रेलवे मैनेजमेंट सर्विस दैट इज आई आर एम एस रीऑर्गेनाइजेशन ऑफ रेलवे बोर्ड ऑन फंक्शनल लाइन्स हेडेड बाई सी आर बी विद फोर मेंबर्स एंड सम इंडिपेंडेंट मेंबर्स द एग्जिस्टिंग सर्विस ऑफ इंडियन रेलवे मेडिकल सर्विसेज दैट इज आई आर एम एस टू बी कॉन्सिक्वेंटली रीनेम्ड एस इंडियन रेलवे हेल्थ सर्विस दैट इज आई आर एच एस Railways has an ambitious program to modernize and provide the highest standards of safety, speed and service to the passengers with a proposed investment of rupees 50 lakh crore over the next 12 years. This requires speed and scale and a unified agile organization to work focusedly on this task and capable of responding to the challenges. Today's reform are in a series of reform that have been undertaken under the present government including merger of railway budget with union budget, delegation of powers to empower GMs and field officers allowing competitive operators to run trains etc to meet the next level challenges and deal with various existing difficulties there was a need to take this step unlike railway system the world over which have been corporatized indian railways is managed by the government directly it is organized into various departments such as traffic civil mechanical electrical signal and telecom etc These departments are vertically separated from top to bottom and are headed by the secretary level officer in the railway board. This organization of department runs deep down to the grassroots level of the railways. Unification of services will end this departmentalism, promote smooth working of railways, expedite decision making, create a coherent vision for organization and promote rational decision making. Unification of services has been recommended by the various committees for reforming railways. It is now proposed to create a unified group A service called Indian Railways Management Services from the next recruitment cycle. Creation of new services will be done in consultation with Department of Personnel and Training and UPSC to facilitate recruitment in the next recruitment year. It will enable railways to recruit engineers and non-engineers as per the need and offer equality of opportunity to both categories in career progression. The modalities and unification of service will be worked out by the Ministry of Railways in consultation with DOPT with approval of alternative mechanism with appointment by the cabinet in order to ensure fairness and transparency. The process shall be completed within a year. The newly recruited officer will come from engineering and non-engineering discipline as per the need and posted as per their aptitude and specialization to allow them to specialize in one field and develop an overall perspective and prepare them to take up general management responsibility at the senior levels. Selection for general management position shall be through a merit-based system. Railway board will no longer be organized on department lines and replaced with a linear structure organized on functional lines. It will have a chairman who will act as the CEO along with four members responsible for infrastructure, operation and business development, rolling stock and finance respectively. The board will also have some independent members who will be highly distinguished professionals with deep knowledge and some 30 years of experience including at top levels in industry, finance, economics and management fields. The independent members will help the railway board in setting a strategic direction. The restructured board will start functioning after approval of board taking due care to ensure the officers are posted in the restructured board or adjusted in the same pay and rank till their retirement. If you like the video do share for more such videos keep watching my channel